Hey, what's going on, guys? Over the past month or so, I've been um, putting up the community posts. I don't know how I got community posts. I'm pretty sure that they... Uh, it used to be you needed a thousand subscribers. I'm not positive on that, but either way, um, I did get the community posts uh, tab turned on on my channel, and I've been making a few. You know, we've had a little fun with them, and uh, I just want to go over it. Let's review a few of them. Actually, we'll re review all of them. We'll go through. We'll have a little fun. So uh, stand by, and um, we'll, we'll, we'll have a little fun, hopefully. Okay, so my first community post was... Uh, What's best, silver, gold, guns, or cash? Um, I had uh, 77 votes on this, uh, 11 thumbs up, and 40 comments. Now, gold came in uh, first at 38%. Silver came in second at 34%. Guns came in at 23%, and cash came in at a measly 5%. Um, there was a lot of great comments on this post, and... Uh, yeah, it was pretty pretty fun. It was my first community post. So, uh, silver, gold, guns, and cash. Gold, gold inched it out uh, over silver and guns and cash. So, uh, yeah, that was a pretty fun one. So, my second um, community post was was um, another what's best. It was what's best, one ounce bars, five ounce bars, ten ounce bars, or kilo bars, or who gives a shit, silver is silver, jackass. Um, so 10 ounce bars, uh, took the, uh, took it on this one, 42% of, uh, of you said 10 ounce bars, um, coming in second, uh, 38% of the people, uh, called me a jackass and said, who gives a shit, silver, silver, so, um, I can appreciate that, five ounce bars came in, uh, number three at 13%, one ounce bars, number four at 8%, and not one goddamn person voted for a kilo bar. Uh, that sort of, sort of, I can't believe that, but uh, that nobody voted for a kilo bar. But hey, man, that's the beautiful thing about these uh, community posts. You see what's, you know, on the minds of other people. And, you know, 38% of the people uh, on their mind was, uh, you know, hey, man, who gives a shit? Silver, silver, jackass. So, uh, yeah, that was a pretty good one. So the third community post I put out was, what should my next purchase be? Uh, two, two choices here, one-tenth gold eagle or a full roll of walkers. Uh, 70 votes on this thing, uh, doing pretty good there. 19 comments, 15 likes, and uh, the overwhelming majority uh, was a full roll of walkers. So 66% of, you say, walkers, um, I had 34 people, 34% uh, of the people say one-tenth uh, gold eagle. So I did take your guys' uh, advice on this one, and I did get a an extra full roll of walkers, $12 face in a $10 tube. So that was a great purchase, and, uh, you know, I, I was teetering which way to go on this one, but uh, you guys totally killed it for me, and uh, I did get that um, $12 face roll of... Uh, of walkers and I'm loving them. So I did wind up getting the 10, uh, the one tenth gold eagle later on though. But, um, for this one here, I did definitely get the, uh, walkers first. So my next community post was, it was, I like my Morgans and we had five choices here. Lightly toned, rainbow toned, blast white, deep mirror proof like, or dark toned. So, uh, Blast White came in first at 35%. We had, uh, 63 votes on this one, 11 likes, 13 comments, and, um, Blast White came in first at 35%. We had Rainbow Toned at 27% coming in second. I didn't think Rainbow Toned was that popular, man. Uh, I mean, you know, maybe not like Monster Rainbow Toned, but I just put Rainbow Toned, so... Um, I can definitely dig the, you know, a little bit of rainbow toned. I should have put monster rainbow toned in there, but because those are horrible looking to me personally, I don't know. But so either way, lightly toned came in uh, third place at 20 sec uh, 22%. Um, I like the lightly toned. I think personally, I like the lightly toned uh, Morgan's best um, because it gives them a little character and they, they just look really good. 
Blast White looks a little fake. Deep Mirror Proof like to me. DMPO looks a little fake to me. That came in f uh, actually fifth place. The uh, DMPLs came in fifth fifth place out of here, three percent, and the dark toned came in uh, actually fourth percent at thirteen percent. Um, I hate the dark toned, the dark toned and the rainbow, the monster rainbow toned um, are pretty damn ugly to me. So, uh, bottom line is, uh, yeah, that was a pretty good um, community post there. Okay, this one for with this one was for when I when I hit my hundred ounces of silver. Actually, it was like a a hundred and sixteen ounces of silver. I was gonna do a hundred ounce um you know video like my first hundred ounces, but then I was like you know what should I just do a live stream? It would have been my first live stream on the channel. So I put out a community post saying should I do a one hundred ounce live stream uh this coming up Sunday morning, which was that Sunday morning, but. Uh, 53 votes here, 15 likes, 17 comments, 60% of you guys said, yes, I'll be there. Thank you very much. And you know what? It was a great turnout. We had a, I, I think it was a, a pretty, a pretty fun morning. That live stream went like almost two hours. So, uh, 34% of you just said to just make a goddamn video, mother flower. So, um, and then 6% 6 of you jokers told me to fuck off. You said, fuck off, PMG. So 6% uh, of you want me to fuck off. 34% of you said, just make a goddamn video. And 60% of you said, yes, you'll be there. And you guys were there. Um, I had a, a pretty decent amount of uh, people in the chat. And um, thank you very much to everybody who was there. So that was a, a fun live stream and my first and only live stream so far. So... Uh, yeah, so, um, the live stream was great, and, uh, uh, I'm, you know, up over 100 ounces, and I'm loving it, so, uh, the next community post was, is now a good time to trade silver for gold, and this was two weeks ago, um, overwhelmingly, 87% of you guys said, no, it is not a good time to trade silver for gold, and uh thirteen percent of you said yes, so I'm pretty surprised about that because um I don't think uh you know it's really a great time to trade silver for gold when when you're at uh you know eighty you know eighty to one or so but bottom line is hey man it's uh, if you got the silver and you want to trade up for gold you know that's that's awesome regardless of the ratio but um eighty seven percent of uh ninety five votes man ninety five votes. 11 thumbs up on this, 7 comments, and uh, yeah, overwhelming majority is uh, now is not a good time to trade silver for gold. Okay, the next one was, do you think silver has the potential to hit $50? Um, and I was referring to like a spot price of $50 in 2022. Uh, 100 votes on this thing, exactly uh, 12 Thumbs up, 17 comments, and God damn it, if it wasn't just about a dead heat here, 51% um, to 49% um, say that silver does have the potential to hit $50 in 2022. So 51% of you said yes, 49% said no. So I'm calling that almost a, a dead heat. Um, where it's a split decision almost, you know what I mean, on silver's potential to hit a $50 spot price in 2022. And with shit going on, with stuff going on all around, um, you know, in, in, you know, just about every aspect of, of today's world, um, hey man, it, it's hard to say, but, but, um, you know, split decision here, um, the yeses have it, but, uh, yeah. I mean, I'm sure some of us would love to see it hit 50. Some of us would hate to see it hit 50. But, um, hey, man, it is what it is. And uh, there was one very funny comment on there um, that said, uh, silver might not have the potential to hit $50 in 2022, but gas definitely does. And that was hilarious. But anyway, yeah, split decision, uh, 51 to 49 on uh, silver's potential for $50 in 2022. The next community post I posted was, would you rather have one 100 ounce bar, 10 10 ounce bars, or 100 one ounce bars? 
We had 123 votes on this. Nice. Very nice. Uh, 28 thumbs up, 38 comments. This was a controversial one. Um, and 65% uh, of you say 100 one-ounce bars, 30% with 10-ounce bars, and a measly 5% of you said one 100-ounce bar. I think the 100-ounce bar uh, thing is, like, awesome to just, you know, have in your mind. Like, you know, it would be awesome to have a 100-ounce bar, but... And 10 10 ounce bars, you you can't go wrong with either way. But uh, 100 one ounce bars for the fractionability of them was 65% of the votes here. And most of the comments were, you know, for fractionability. If you need to get rid of one or two ounces, you don't have to get rid of a, a 10 ounce bar or sell a 100 ounce bar, which makes total sense. It's a, it's a good, you know, it's a good... Uh, you know, 100 one ounce bars is definitely the right way to go on that. But, um, yeah, put it out there. You guys voted awesome. 123 votes. And, uh, the 100 one ounce bars took this one, uh, piece of cake. So now my last community post, uh, was, I was just having a little bit of fun. I was having a little bit of fun with Bullion Baby. And, um, we'll get to that post now. Okay. The last community post I've put up one day ago, um, I think we should start a fund to get Bullion Baby a damn tripod. Now, Bullion Baby, every video he does, it's like one-handed, and he's like, with the other hand, he's like trying to open up mail and packages and uh, rolls of half dollars or whatever he's doing, he's doing it one-handed, you know what I mean? So I'm saying to myself, and he said something, he mentioned something about a tripod in that video, the last one I watched. Um, I forget which one it was, but... He mentioned a tripod, something about a tripod, and I'm saying to myself, you know what, Bullion Baby needs a damn tripod. So I put out a community post saying that I think we should start a fund to get Bullion Baby a damn tripod. So with 63 votes, 12 likes, 17 comments, uh, we have, an, uh, you know, 43% of you coming in in the number one spot, 43% of you say, let Bullion Baby buy his own shit. So, uh, yeah, you know what? Bullion Baby's a grown man. Let him buy his own shit, right? So, and then at coming in second at 37% is who the hell is Bullion Baby? Now, anybody who's answering my community posts or watching my channel definitely should know who the hell Bullion Baby is. So, um, I don't know what's going on with that, but 37% of the 63 votes don't even know who, who the hell Bullion Baby is, goddammit. So, Son of a bitch, I, I don't like that, but... And then 21% uh, of you fine, outstanding individuals said, hell yes, we should start a fund to get Bullion Baby a damn tripod. So, uh, Bullion Baby, it looks like, according to the community post here, you're going to have to buy your own shit. So, uh, <laughs> that's the bottom line, I guess, there. So, uh, and the other 37% who don't know who the hell Bullion Baby is, um, I'm going to leave a goddamn link to Bullion Baby's channel under the in the uh, description box down below. So uh, go find out who Bullion Baby is because uh, you can't you can't live a good life without watching a Bullion Baby video. So anyway, that's the bottom line. And that's the end of the video here. Um, these are my community posts uh, up to date, you know, to date. And um, I've had a lot of fun with them and I hope you guys have too. And uh I'll talk to you guys soon. Keep out of trouble. Stay safe and thanks for watching.